So here are all the components to make the world's absolute smallest computer, at least that I can make, and I have drawn up a diagram of what it's going to look like. Uh, it'll be pretty similar to this, but more like that. So we're going to put it all together, and once it's assembled, then I will have a really tiny computer. If you were expecting me to see if it fit in my nostrils or run over with a car, I, no. Alright, so we've got a, a couple of really high-tech, expensive items here. Uh, the first being this Dell logo. I just, I just want it to be a Dell, okay? Here we've got the tiniest camera I could possibly find. Super tiny camera. So the actual computer, I really did want it to be able to, like, maybe draw in MS Paint without blue screening. Uh, I did, of course, order the world's tiniest HDMI cable. There were actually much smaller ones. But this one was the only one that... that I got. Does this even have an HDMI port? No, it doesn't, does it? Well, that's a problem. There's no HDMI on here. Why do I think there would be? Can I not look at a picture? I got the icon case for Erpy 4 b That's Erpy 4 b Yes, it comes with red decal sticker. Oh my gosh, it comes with also the world's tiniest fan. This is a bonus, bonus extra, world tiniest fan. I'm putting it in the title. We're gonna put the Dell logo on it and it's gonna, I'm gonna have a tiny little Dell computer. Oh my gosh, it comes with the world's tiniest heat sinks. I can now wash my dishes in my tiniest heat sinks. My, my world's tiny dishes. Now this one's not as tiny as I could have gotten, but there's a reason. It's because I don't want to go blind. This is the monitor here. I think it's actually a touch screen. And I only say that because it comes with literally a Nintendo DS stylus. Yes, this is a DS Lite stylus. This is actually fantastic. Let's get some risers and things. High technic technicality components, you guys don't have to worry about that. That's why you came to watch this video. For my electronic prowers. So here's a really tiny USB mouse. And I got this one specifically because it's small, you dingus. Why do you think? And lastly, Raspberry Rye for those of you on a high fiber diet. This is just a really tiny keyboard. It's got nice rubbery buttons. It's got a slide pad on it if you that if you swing that way. Now you might be asking yourself, why, Peter, uh, do you go from making a video dissecting the Sonic fandom to making a tiny PC? I actually did go to school for a two-year degree in, uh, in network systems and technology. So I'm probably the best person on YouTube to be plugging cords into obvious ports, using my high technology skills to be able to connect A to B this, this joke actually doesn't work because there is no HDMI port. Pretending to be dumb isn't funny when you really are dumb. Bonus, world's tiniest screwdriver. Put that in the title. Also add world's tiniest brain because I don't know what I'm doing. Have you ever wanted to build a very giant piece of doo doo? Well, you've not clicked on the right video. Use it on the drill here. Ah, well, that's it. It's jammed in the capaci capacitor. The gaskets are, are plugged. Here's the actual Raspberry Pi instruction. Actually, it's in the entire United States Dictionary. <laughs> when I say United States. See, it says power in. World's tiniest text. Extra bonus added to the title. Install the Raspberry Pi and the four heat sinks. I don't have a degree in plumbing, but haha, -ha, funny joke, Peter. So the big one goes over the processor, which is a processor. All right, my stupid is shrinking a bit. I actually figured it out. Boom. Mini Dell computer. Got all our tiny little thingy thingies. World's tiniest nut! That's a weird sentence. Don't put that one in the title. Thick thing here. The world's tiniest monitor. Please ignore any video game handheld monitor, such as the Game Boy. That doesn't count. Computer and a monitor. Look how cute this is! And just to put this into perspective scale, here's the world's tiniest Spyro. And what sucks is. Now I have to wait for a micro HDMI cable to arrive, and a micro SD card. Funny how they have micro in the name and I didn't think I'd need any of them. So for me, now I must wait another three or four days before actually getting to use this. But guys, through the magic of YouTube and editing, you won't need to wait at all for me to get this going because you'll be in the same video. Or I am quirky YouTuber acknowledging the fourth wall. Guys, I've discovered the first 
Renewable energy source. Could put that in the title now too. All right, I'm gonna order the things. Time travel begins. Oh my knees! Ah. Uh... You can go. Twenty days later. All right. Well, it's been a week or so. What kind of design is this? It's got the tear mark where you're supposed to tear, and but the zip seal is above it. Why do I care? With these two tiny cables combined, we now have the world's second smallest HDMI cable. Also, in the meantime, uh, videos popped up in my recommended of the world's making the world's smallest computer. I didn't know that other people had already made a video based on this concept. Um, it seems pretty obvious that there would be. Uh, so, you know, that's my blonde speaking. But I didn't personally know of any, so I'm not copying anyone. The video still has some worth to it now, because that's that's what determines video worth. We now transition to uh, the world's tiniest desk that I've probably handcrafted. I don't know, because I haven't decided how I'm going to set that up yet. Alright, here we are. This is the world's smallest table. I can just grab it if I wanna. It's a regular table. I was too lazy to find a small one. Now, there's I've had a history in this channel of plugging in power sources to things that are, it's the wrong power source, and uh, it ends up frying things such as AV converters. Mostly just those. I've, I've roasted a few of them. So the power for these are coming directly out of the wall. I don't know if they're supposed to be We might have only five minutes until it roasts itself. There it is! There you go! Yeah, I didn't put an OS on this. Yeah, actually. So, OS? I did it! I saw that. I saw that blueberry. You like this cool thing I can do with this SD card? Yeah, it's, yeah, it's kind of my quirk. Welcome to the Raspberry Pi desktop. So this camera, I realized, also needs a micro SD card. <laughs> that really suck if I had to wait another while to make more videos. So I'm not, I'm not gonna. Okay, I'm not even kidding. I actually have to go somewhere. So <laughs> same time tomorrow. D's not. Ha. Oh, hey, time to maybe use computer. I can't even read this. Shut up. All right, let's browse. Let's go to the browser. We already got trash bin. That's pretty cool. Let's check out some Twitter. We have arrived at Twitter. Whoa, dead people. Well, the recording stopped. Okay, so the whole thing just rebooted. That's what that was. Oh, I gotta type in that again. For goodness flippins. All right, we're back here. I'm in the world of smallest PC. Very hard to type. Please send links to games. I'm sure nine if them will run. Tiniest tweet I've ever sent. World's tiniest tweet right here, boys. Well, good responses. Now, Minecraft. I'm pretty sure there was somewhere you could play Minecraft in browser. Minecraft. Oh, it is. Awesome. And there goes the screen again. This little dude boy, I hear it. Ah, uh, yeah, it just <laughs> it crashed again. All right, let's try that one more time. It's gonna go into full screen. Maybe crash? All right, we'll try something else. Small Minecraft. Do whatever you need to do to just function correctly. I will give you... One week. I can barely fit all my fingers on the Wazdas. Here we go. Oh, it is... Shut up! Now that I'm playing it, I realize I didn't think of anything sound related for this computer, so... You might hear sound on the recorder, but I don't have any speakers or... or anything, so... It's getting dark. No. No. I can't even see anymore. Old Sonic game ports. You know, that actually is possible. I have faith that someone's put Sonic R in a browser for some reason. I feel like that'd be the game they choose. Okay, yeah, this actually is a thing. That's awesome. I beg you. 
No, I kind of wonder if my recorder is messing it up a little bit. So I'm gonna try without and see if it crashes less. I wonder if we can get a different browser for this, like Firefox or something. So it's apparently called Ice Weasel for Firefox, which is kind of funny. I actually did learn how to use this specifically in school. Linux or Ubuntix or... Boo, yeah, chip, baba boy. All right, Firefox. Will Firefox play Sonic R as it was designed to do? I spoke to John Firefox. He said we designed it to play Sonic R. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I thought the game was gonna pop up here. <laughs> Come on! It doesn't like anything! Start up! I, I love how I get half of the screen to browse Twitter and the other half is bar, 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 bar. We'll try one other thing. Mini clips? Maybe. All right, you know what? Well, uh... <laughs> Can you... I'm having a crisis. I'm just going to attempt to make one drawing. There's got to be some kind of art program. I'm going to do one drawing, and if I can do that successfully, that's it. We're done. Cutesy pootsy world's tiniest art. Let's go. This has to be a thing, right? JS paint, good enough. All right, so we get our painty things here. Pencil tool, or no, is this a brush? It's just really hard to see everything. And we will do the one thing I know how to do. He does look a little bit sad. I've drawn a Sonic. I'm... His jeans are baggy, let it be told. This is accurate. This is really difficult. Oh, that's me. Also just having a great day. That's about what my hair is like. And not too many people know this about me, but my legs only make up 10% of my entire body height. Cool! That is good. How do I save this? Twit? I've tweeted. Took a big old twit. Oh, I went to the bathroom and twat myself. Okay, so that's been the world's tiniest PC. I will probably do more with this uh, when I figure out all the bugs and bells and whistles. I want to get Windows running on this, so that may be a future thing. This was introductory, surface level, me getting into the world of dealing with this crud. And outros are overrated. Goodbye! I noticed um, something very interesting. If I turn it off here, and you look at the screen, just the right way, it says Educational Sonic Games. Written in fingerprint! Who cares?